Hi guys, Michael here. Today I invite you to join me for a dip into a Danish lake. Early spring on the Trout Lake has a special vibe of life, expectations and hope for the coming season. After the spring turnover of the water column, trout can be anywhere again. So it means we can swing a line again, but trout in this lake are few and precious. And you have to put in an effort to be able to land and release one of these beauties. Basically, that means covering a lot of water. But as soon as the spring sun warms the shallows, the food chain start up in the protected environment in the reeds along the shoreline. That's when bait fish, in this case sticklebacks and smelt, leave their winter biotopes of the depth and move in close to shore to feed on small Daphnia, copepods, mosquito larva, glassworms and other tasty stuff. And they seek the reeds for protection as well. For a short while that narrow line between land and open water can be a bit crowded. And trout, perch and other predators cruise close to shore. Note how close these sticklebacks swim. And how the many individuals act like one organism when they start moving. I love watching wildlife films from National Geographic, BBC and others, but I also feel a rush of joy and amazement every time I put an underwater camera down in local streams and rivers. Often what looks dead from the surface will blow your mind when you get down below. I hope you enjoyed the dip. Thanks for watching.